guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Karen and the name of my channel is PR Girl for Puerto Rican Girl. I hope that everyone is doing well and safe. In today's video, I have something different for you. I'm going to be sharing with you my last purchase from Trollbiz, Texas. I know it has been months, months and months and months. I purchased this probably it was at the end of February or March. And yes, I have been holding since then to film a video. I always said, I'm going to film it, I'm going to film it, and I'm going to use it. But this is going to be a true unboxing. I have been holding for this for this long, believe it or not. You know, it's just time, time. I need to find more time. So I was so grateful for the girls, Anna, and, you know, everyone at Trobis, Texas, for them to be able to send me this amazing piece. I have always wanted one on my collection to store my bits, of course, and I'm so excited. They ship it to me through FedEx here in Puerto Rico, and yeah, it's just amazing. Very beautiful packaging, as always. I miss them so much, and yeah, so this is going to be an unboxing. Um, there is where I store my current Trollbits collection. That's the Stackers Jewelry Box, the mini one, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to fill this up because my Trollbits collection is not that big, but I do have a nice Beats collection, as you guys know, and I can probably also store Beats from my other brands in here as well. So yeah, so I hope you enjoy watching and just, just open this right away. I'm so excited. Okay, let's start. It's a big box. As you can see, I love that they have this protector sleeve. Because, you know, that can get some dirt. And so here is the box. Let's open it together. Oh, and I see some. Oh, my goodness. As you can see, I chose the gray one. I'm going to go through the side here because it's pretty big. And, oh, my goodness. Wow. And it's heavy. It's heavy, you guys. It's and heavy. then I saw on the sleeve that says Trollby 8 last s collector's case and the color is anthracite i think that's the color if i'm not mistaken there's the item number and of course it says one as a quantity i know other beats collectors who has some sort of this collector case ali has exactly the same one i know that from bandura charm and then also linda from lsn2 i know she has the previous version so yeah i'm just over the moon so that's the mechanism to open it. And oh, I hope you were able to see all the rods over here, the beat bars. I know I heard that you're supposed to, what, like pull it from the side. Is that it? Yes. So there you go. I don't know how many we have in here. I have to double check. So let me do that. Let's see how many we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And there are three, so that's 24. And I think that you can probably store a lot of them in here. I need to get used to placing them. So there you go. That's amazing. Wow, I'm gonna have lots of storage indeed. And then, oh, this feels so nice. There's a sleeve here, velvety material. And on the other side, it's like cardboard. Yes, that's cardboard. And then here is more space for storage. I hope you're able to see from there. I know it's dark. So here you have some space for bracelets. So I'm wearing a bangle today, just a bangle. There you go. I'm having here a unique in the center and also one of these leaves, um, what is it, the maple leaves, and then also some round stones, as well as the garden of the forest bead, which is the silver one, and this is my star bangle, so there is, you can see there's plenty of space in here to place bracelets, and I know that in here you can also place the bracelets that are the foxtail already composed, and here you can place bangles like this one, I know there's some space here for rings. I'm wearing today my Daisy ring, the two tones. And so I can put it there for you to see. There you go. 
this is gonna be so exciting and then there is some space in here to put more beads ah oh, my goodness this is gonna be so fabulous so what i will do really quick is that i'm gonna get all my beads from my mini stackers jewelry box maybe i can show you really quick oops <laughs> the way i have it now on top of it i have all my um i would say like stone beads as well as some uniques in there i also store my two leather bracelets one is a single bracelet one is the double one with the yellow i also have in here because it's a big one my pickup pendant as well as one of the um foxtail bracelets so that's the top layer and then in the bottom layer here i have my um foxtail bracelet my other foxtail bracelet i only own two so perhaps i can put that one right away so there you go that's the way to store it and then i have my other bangle which is the twisted i have my rings and then some other beads so what i will do now really quick is to put everything on my um, collector case and then show you the final result. So I'm making a pause here to show you about how many you can fit on one of those um, big bars or rods. We have here three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Of course, will depend on the size of the bead. I think I'm gonna um, remove this one so I could keep like ten or so. I will see. So there you see them on the collector's case, and I have two more stones in here, which are. No, only one. The lapis lazuli. I have one more in there. But I'm missing also... Oh, I know. I'm missing also this one, which is my amethyst. And I'm currently having it on my fantasy necklace. Same design I showed you a few weeks ago. So perhaps I can put it on one of these um, spaces. Yes, oh, that's perfect. So there are one, two, three, four, five... Um, six spaces of those and as you could see I couldn't put in there my crown ring because it's a little bit wider so it's perfect to put it on one of those places and I think you can see that it holds sort of like um eight rings in here they look beautiful and perfect and so yeah I think I'm gonna store my pendants also on these little ones um i have this one and um perhaps like bigger beads like this one um maybe the frame by which is this one the one that i have with the start that is a larger one i also have my owl pendant perhaps i can put it there as well and also this heart pendant um, yeah, maybe keep the pendants there and then more delicate beads on the other side, like that one, which was the new wisdom bead. And yeah, I think, um, yes, there's one more in here, which is the one with the bow. I also have one and only one pair of earrings, which are this one with the snowflake. Hmm, and I need to make sure that I store them properly so they don't tangle. And so perhaps I can put that right here in the back. And so I will do the rest of the beads on the um, bars and show you. So this is my entire Troll Beats collection. I say it's not that big, but I'm very happy with it, of course, with time. I'm pretty sure I will fill this out more because I have lots on my wish list. But as you can see, I was able to fill out how many? One, two, three, nine of these rods with my bees. 
And so that means I have 15 left. So yeah, plenty to go. Um, I place in here all my silvers as well as in this part. Here I have some of that, um, those bits from that kit. I think it's called the harvest kit. I'm missing two, I think, to complete the entire set. No, I'm missing three because I have one that is the same. And then in here I place some of my glass beads. Of course, you see a lot of them in pink, orange, warm tones because you guys know I love those. In here I have one of my kits, which is the forest life kit or something like that. I have some of my new pearls in here as well as my round stones. And then this one, which is the color of heart. Um, and then I also place in here my spacers and two of my locks. And um, yeah, I'm just very excited to have this in my collection. We always struggle with bead and charm space. And I wish that more brands do things like this because we need them. We need these spaces to have our beautiful beads. Well, you guys, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoy watching, unboxing my new Trollbees collector's case i'm pretty excited about it i hope that it doesn't get that gush of dirt because i just love it the material is so soft and clean anyhow i hope you enjoyed watching this video as i said and if you did please remember to give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel i will really appreciate having you here thank you very much for watching i will see you in the next one bye bye gracias